1.65. So it's more than a, a second, 1.5 seconds faster, more than one and a half seconds faster race four was than race three. Johnny Peters, master of the skies. Number two comes through here for the Paul Peter Stable. Gavin Arena aboard here. Well done. Nice to have these colours back in the winner's box. And um, Gavin, uh, well done in the winner this afternoon. These form lines were strong and this horse won nicely. He won a very nice race today, Lyle. Um, he gave me a nice feel. And, you know, I'm sure he's going to improve from this. Yeah, certainly. Yeah, always nice to get these horses that do uh, improve like this. And uh, you do think, yeah, he could win a few more, obviously. Yeah, definitely. Um, you know, in, just in the manner in which he won... Um, you know, he really turned it on for me that last for long and a bit. And, uh, you know, he moves very well under you. So I'm sure he's going to improve. Just quickly before your thank yous, uh, how's the track out there this afternoon? It's wonderful. Uh, the track's in good condition. Um, there's a nice cushion to today, obviously, with it being a bit bit softer from the rain, from a little bit of rain. So I think we'll have a great day's race. And how's the uh, weather? It's chilly. Um, yeah. I'm warm now. Yeah. I had a break after the second and got out into the parade ring for the third and I was shivering and shaking but uh i'm warm again good man just uh, one more question um any mm. angel and uh it is a brave star both chances in their respective races yeah i, d I don't know the filly in the next race um i, I don't know at all uh, one on the mother so i must be getting quite old oh, there we go <laughs> <laughs> and, and brave, uh, star. brave star he ran disappointing last time but it was his first run back and it was straight into 1800 I thought he'd see out the trip, but he got a nasty bump about 600 out, and, you know, he lost his legs from there. He was never in it. So, you know, we're nicely drawn. If I can get a smooth trip around, he'll be competitive. Thank you, Gavin. Thanks very much, and big thank you to Mr. Peter, to Johnny, to Robin and their whole team. Well done. And to Uncle Johnny, Peter, great to, to ride a win in his socks again. Well said, Gavin. Thank you so much. Thank you. Well done to Gavin. As I said, we're going to fix the uh, microphone and we're getting the lovely Robin in to come and chat to us on behalf of the Paul Peter Stable. Firstly, Robin, thank you so much for coming to chat to us. Um, how's the day going so far? Well, good, obviously. We cold. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, a bit cold out here. But this, uh, this horse here, um, those form lines were strong. It was a good win last time out and uh, improved even further today. Yes, well done to Johnny and uh, thank you to Harper Paint. Well done, well said. I can please ask you about the other runners. We've got Peter Shimon, of course, the <coughs> first-timer, uh, Grace from Above in race number six uh, coming up. Grace from Above, um, he's, he's a nice colt. We're hoping for a good run from him. Peter Shim, it's the third run after the gelding, so hoping for a bit of improvement there. Hoping for some improvement. Then race seven, Gypsy King. Um, Tony seems to like this horse. I uh, guess first-timers, you never know, but hoping for a good run. And then finally, uh, Golden Duke in uh, race nine. Yeah, um, they've put the blinkers on him now and uh, also hoping for an improved run. Hopefully well, you. you can run into the places. Appreciate that and lovely seeing those colours in and well done to the whole Paul Peter team. Thank you very much. Thank you so much. Ed, to Robbins coming representing the Paul Peter stable. Number two, Master of the Skies, son of Mumbo in Seattle. This one bred by Mutton Sukka. Mr. Peter, lovely to have your colours back in the winner's box here. It is two, six, twelve and three. That is race number four. Jackpot one coming up next. Fourteen hundred meters, start of the pick six, and they fired away. 
Grazing in the grass, a bit slow with Earl and Bold Resolve. Master of Disguise jumped away well with the contractor. Eskimo Pie is wider out and back to black has a handy early position. Al Harmi's along the rail. Gives the leader is about uh, 